Welcome back. Today, I'm in the Yorkshire Dales. I thought I'd bring you with me. I've got my gear on back. Hang on a minute. No, it's over there on the floor. Let's roll the titles. Well, like I said earlier, I'm in the Yorkshire Dales. And today, it's Ribblehead Viaduct. On this cold and frosty morning, and snow lingering from the weekend, it's it's really cold at the minute, but not as cold as I was expecting. Um, it's just stunning. It really is. It really is. I have been here before, about three, four years ago. Um, did some night shots and did the wire wall in between one of the arches. Um, if I can find the photos, I'll put them up in a second. Well, got my first shot set up. Uh, I've got the leading line of the road leading into the viaduct. Um, I've got a graduated filter on, just as cheap ones at the minute. I just want to try them, see what I'm, see if I like them or not. I normally use the circular ones, uh, which is a little cheap thing from eBay. Uh, nothing spectacular. I even think the um, slides are plastic, but it's worth a try. Um, if I, if I like them, I'll invest in a bit more, get some better ones, Lee or Nissy ones, something like that. I'm not sure yet, I need to do some research on them. Anyway, back to the shot. Um, here it is. Let's have a look at Luke. That's, that's what I'm getting. Uh, I'm at F8, not sure what the speed is yet. Um, let's have a quick look, in fact, see what it, see what it says. In fact, turn it on first. The 20th of second F8, ISO 100. So let's have a look at that, see what it turns out like. Well, I've moved to completely the other side now of the viaduct to get another shot. Um, there's two reasons why I've moved over here. One, because I want to get the, the hills full of snow and capture the scene, because there was a big snowfall last weekend they had. Uh, I want to capture that. Plus, I've been told by a gentleman who's walking his dog that the Flying Scotsman is due in the next hour or so, so I want to try and see if I can capture that. And normally, the position where I am, where the Scotsman's coming through, there's absolutely loads of people here. There is loads of people here generally. But today, nope, just me, all on my own. Not even a sh not even sheep around. There's none. It's that cold. So I'm going to take the shot now and wait around for a little bit. Try and keep warm. Um, let's have a look at that shot. See if you like it. Well, I've been here quite a while now, and no sign of the Flying Scotsman, so I don't think he's coming. But knowing my luck, I'll move away from here, and it'll turn up. So, I hope it doesn't, but I hope it does as well, so I can catch it. Right, I'm going to move to my next shot. I'll see you in a minute. As I was making my way over to the other side of the viaduct, I came across this nice little shot of a super colleague. Just looking straight down the viaduct. Um, 
took another one about a minute ago and it's got the um, stone wall leading as a leading line so I've got a picture of those two I think they look quite nice actually with the, the snow in the foreground and the background I think it's, it sets it off quite nice let's have a look see what you think of these I've moved over the other side now and I'm on high ground um, as you can see the hills behind me snow capped very nice very nice indeed right up here obviously the wind's picked up it feels really really cold now um, I think it said one degree for today it feels like a minus one yeah it feels a lot colder than that but anyway back to the next shot um, let's, let's spin you around first, let's have a look at it There's a camera um, I've got the wall as a leading line in and then it leads into the road which then takes up into the viaduct itself I've done a three shot bracket um, F11 yeah three shot bracket F11 um, two shots out of the side um, I'll merge those together in Lightroom. Let's have a look. I think it's going to be quite nice, really. Let's see what you think. shot anyway back to the flying scotsman it's not happening i don't think it's going to happen at all uh, it should have been three got two hours ago not a chance not a chance at all there's probably some leaves stuck on the line somewhere anyway i'm gonna go back down now get some more shots i'll see you down there Well here I am at the base of the viaduct, it's massive, you can see the scale of it here, it's just massive, I'm on the widest I can on this lens, it's the amount of man hours it must have took to build this, but thinking about it I remember a programme a couple of years ago, um, I think it was called Jericho, maybe, maybe not, and I'm sure it was building this viaduct the program was made around. Um, I'll see if I can find it. And if, if I can, I'll link it somewhere. Um, yeah, since I've come down, I've been just doing um, intimate shots. And each one of these sanctions, I'm presuming they're called sanctions, I don't ex exactly know. But comment below if you do. Um, each one's got a water pipe, a drain pipe on each side. So the water up there must be immense. It really must be. Anyway, let's have a look at these shots, see what you think.
well I've had a good day today it's it's been really nice well this been a bit cold but it's a week before Christmas what do you expect really I've had a cheeky day off work I think I've got some good shots as well really thinking back if you've liked what you've seen give us a like and a subscribe and I'll see you next time bye for now